Verizon has a history of network innovation from fiber to the home deployments to uh, wireless deployments in 2G, 3G, 4G, LTE. We've always been at the forefront of those technologies and Verizon intends to continue that lead. The SD and NFE concepts have been around for a long time. It's been quite an evolution. There's been a lot of foundational work done with Intel, with other companies, building up that expertise and, and figuring out what some of the early problems were and doing the feasibility studies and, and really advancing the state of the technology to where it is today. Verizon is using SDN and NFV to fundamentally change the way we're running our network. So we're starting with simple things such as firewalls, load balancers, DNS, but we're also tackling some more complicated functions that have more immediate benefit to the company. Things such as video optimization, private network uh, connectivity solutions for our enterprise customers, or what we're hoping to get from this effort as the industry continues to evolve and continues to move towards hopefully standardized deployments, is the ability to grow our network in a predictable and standardized fashion so that we can pre-place uh, resources in the network and then be able to configure them with software and we can consume those resources for whatever the need of the day is. That's the flexibility and agility part of being able to turn those resources into the product or service that we need at that time. Carrier networks are very reliable, they're very predictable, we've got very rigid processes that we use. Introducing these new technologies and concepts changes a lot of that. And with change always comes challenge. So the way that we can address some of that is really by having a very robust ecosystem and industry culture around this. So the more that we mainstream these technologies, the more that we can build around them in terms of resources and training and things like that, I think the more people will get comfortable that it's this is mainstream, this isn't a, a one-off, this isn't a crazy science experiment, this is the way of the future for the networks. I think it's far more exciting now that we've seen some real world experience, we've got some real world deployments, we see what we can really accomplish with this. There's a lot of work to do in terms of getting to the point where we truly have standards and we truly can scale. Um, but the work that's been done thus far I think has proven out that there is value in what we're doing here and that we can fundamentally change the way we deploy networks for carriers in the future.